subscribe to Tech Me Spot channel and press the bell icon and never miss another update. Hi guys, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create a new user with sudo permission in Kali Linux. Okay, so for this guys we have to follow these four steps. Okay, so first of all we have to open terminal. So let me adjust the window size of this. Okay. And you have to come to the desktop, right click on that and then click on this open in terminal. And guys here we have the terminal opened and, and you can see I'm logged in as a root. Okay. So let me adjust the window size of this terminal also. So here we have the terminal opened and here we have the, uh, you know, this file. Okay. So the step one, uh, create a new normal user by command below. Okay. So the command is user add space dash m space. Uh, username okay guys so you have to type your username that you want okay so i want test user so i i'm typing this okay and dash m creates a home directory for the user okay so just come to the terminal and type that command user add space dash m space test user in my case okay so the command is written after that hit enter key on the keyboard and it's done and step two, we have to set password for the user. Okay, so the command is uh, p a w s w d space username. Okay, so you have to type, you know, your username. I have this test user. Okay, and uh, just go to the terminal and type that command p a w s w d space uh, test user in my case. Okay, and after that, hit enter key on the keyboard. You have to type password that you want for the user. So I am typing mine. After that hit enter, you have to retype your password. Okay, so I'm doing that. After that hit enter. Okay, you can see guys the password updated successfully. Okay, so the step two is done. Uh, let's go to the step three. Now add a user to the sudo group. Uh, this allows a user to install software, use the printer, etc. Okay, so the command is uh, user mode space dash a space dash in capitals g space sudo space username okay so you have to type uh, your username over here i have test user okay so the dash a means add dash g sudo means to add the user to the sudoers group okay so just uh, go to the terminal and type that command user mode space dash a space dash g space sudo space test user okay in my case so you have to type your username over here and after that hit enter key on the keyboard and guys it's done okay and after that we have to follow this you know step four now we have to specify the shell for our new user okay so the command is chsh space dash s space forward slash bin forward slash bash space username okay so you have to type uh, your username over here so i have test user okay so i return test user and uh, chsh means change login shell and dash s means it is the name of the shell you want for the user in this case it is bash okay so let's go to the terminal and let me type that command ch chsh space dash s space forward slash bin forward slash bash forward space test user in my case okay uh, you have to type your username okay and after that hit enter key on the keyboard and guys it's done okay so let me close this terminal and also let me close this file okay and let me log out from this uh, root user okay log out yes click on the log out button Okay guys, so just provide your username. So I have test user. Uh, click on this next button and just provide your password that you have given. And then click on the sign in button. Okay guys, so we are now logged in as new user. Okay. And if I click on this top panel at the top right, you can see here we have the test user. Okay. Okay guys, so let's go to the terminal and let's run a command with sudo and let's see if this is you know, working or not. So let me right click on the desktop, click on this open in terminal. Okay, so here we have the terminal opened and uh, let me uh, type this command sudo apt update 
and hit enter you can see it's asking us for password so let me provide the password and hit enter and you can see guys it's working fine okay guys so you can see the command worked fine okay so that's it thanks for watching if you like my videos please support this channel by subscribing to it thanks bye bye